I have a uh, Low Pro CompuTrekker AW uh, for my camera gear, and uh, this is what's in my bag. Got a 40D with a uh, battery grip and a 24-70 f2.8L. I always leave the hood on and the cap off, uh, so it's ready for shooting uh, much faster than uh, if I had left the cap on, obviously. Uh, the next one would be a 50mm f1.4. Um, uh, attached to it are some extension tubes, 12mm, 20mm, and 36mm, uh, all from uh, Kenko, because Kenko Air is just as good as Canon Air. Next we have the Sigma 70-200 f2.8. This is the older one. It doesn't have the DG designation, um, but the only uh, difference is that the DG means uh, digital. It's got uh, extra coatings to prevent uh, reflections off the back of the sensor uh, from digital cameras. And then we have the 17-40 f4L. For wide angle shots. I used to have the 10 22 uh, EFS, but I found it was all uh, really too wide for what I was uh, shooting. And I just didn't really like it anymore. And then the Canon uh, Speedlight 580EX. Don't use it very often. Probably should. Uh, hood for the 40 to or 17 to 40, neck strap. Um, I don't keep it on the camera all the time, um, but I've got uh, carabiner hooks to make it easy to put it on and off. A stack of filters here. We got our UV, uh, circular polarizer, and then a, a three-stop neutral density. Uh, you can combine the neutral density and the circular polarizer to get about five stops. Um, it's really good for waterfalls and stuff. And here we've got our uh, extra batteries. Three of them. Uh, T-mount adapter. Um, bought this a few years ago so I could uh, mount my camera to a friend's uh, telescope and get some uh, astrophotography images with it uh, as well as uh, the moon. Um, I used it to shoot uh, the uh, lunar eclipse that we had back in uh, February of uh, uh, 08. Got some really good shots. Um, ah, yes, and then we've got some uh, color gels for the flash. Um, some various intensities of amber uh, if I'm mixing it with uh, tungsten light. Uh, also got some various intensities of green if I'm mixing with old school fluorescent. And then just uh, a regular green, red and blue for uh, special effects. I don't use them very often, uh, uh, but they, they have come in handy more than once. And here we've got cables. Lots of cables. We've got a um, remote cable release, the shutter, USB cable, a video cable for if I'm hooking up to a TV monitor, LumaQuest softbox. This is a flash diffuser. Just attaches with Velcro fairly quickly. And it gives you a larger, larger size light source uh, for softer shadows and whatnot. Uh, I haven't used that very often either, but that's just because I simply don't use the flash very often. I prefer shooting uh, with ambient light. It folds up pretty quick too. Oh, and then this fell out, uh, just a stand for the flash, and a Nikon uh, lens cloth. And here, we've got a uh, screwdriver for my tripod, because it's constantly uh, loosening screws. Lens pen, you know, I use that more often than the cloth. Got an expo balance from Lasto Light. We've got 18% uh, gray and then half a stop under and over. And then white, black, and 18% gray on the other side for uh, 
uh, for white balance and uh, whatnot. Just folds up and slides back in here. And then spare batteries for the flash. Um, I use lithiums because uh, I never know how long uh, the batteries will be, have to go without being recharged. Lithiums, they don't self-discharge like uh, nickel metal hydrides do, and um, they're a lot better than alkalines. Um, they can recycle the flash almost as fast as a nickel metal hydride, whereas an, an alkaline, it just it craps out real quick. And uh, spare memory, just an Extreme 3 1 gig. I've got a 4 gig in the camera. I don't shoot with this one very often because of the 4 gig. It's, it just holds over a thousand images, and uh, I've never shot that many without being uh, near a computer to offload them. And in here, just for quick reference, in case I need them, the manuals. Never needed the 40D, but the custom functions on the 580EX, um, in the flash itself, it's just numbered. And if you don't know what those numbers mean, you're pooched. So I use the uh, the custom function quick reference page. Uh, if I ever need to change anything, uh, I've had to do it a few times, um, but not so often anymore. And uh, that's about it, I think. Yep. Thanks for watching.